Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Cameron Butts, senior class president at Lake Taylor High School. At this time, we will have the presentation of colors by our Lake Taylor High School NJROTC. On behalf of our senior class of Lake Taylor High School, I would like to thank my fellow graduates, your families and friends, the faculty and staff of Lake Taylor High School, Dr. Sharon Birdsong, Superintendent of Norfolk Public Schools, Dr. Noel Gabriel, Norfolk Public School Board Chairperson, Dr. Michael Cataldo, Acting Deputy Superintendent of Academics, Mr. John Coleman, Executor, Executive Director of Secondary Schools and Programs, members of the Central Administration of Norfolk Public School Boards, uh, Ms. Wade Jenkins, principal of Lake Taylor High School, and her administration for making this event possible. Our ceremony, although different in format, is truly a ceremony. We made it, and we are here together to rejoice and inspire as we move toward our next steps in the world. In every graduating class, there are two students who define the top academic potential of their peers. Today, our salutatorian and valedictorian will present their messages for the graduating class of 2020. First, this year's salutatorian plans on majoring in mechanical engineering at Old Dominion University. After Old Dominion University, his goal is to continue his educational journey at Virginia Tech and to become an automation engineer, working on the cutting edge of technology and its progress. At this time, it is my pleasure to introduce our senior class salutatorian, Alvin Lin. All right. Good day, ladies, gentlemen, faculty, and the class of 2020. And welcome to our graduation ceremony. I would like to congratulate each one of you for completing this journey. I would like to thank the teachers for helping us realize our potential and our counselors for helping us plan out our futures. I also want to thank my parents for supporting me along the way. And students, let's take a moment for each one of you to thank your family members for the same support that they have given you over the years. I believe I speak on behalf of the graduating class of 2020 when I say that we wouldn't have gotten to this moment without all of this love and support. 
Many students in this class will have to leave friends and family behind as they move on to new experiences and new places. Parents will be sad that the child they raised for all those years is leaving them. But today, be happy, because today is the beginning of the most important phase of our lives. Some people may feel that high school is the highlight of our lives, but I would disagree. High school is simply one of the, our early chapters, the foundation to set us, to allow us to appreciate and accept the joys and challenges that life still has to offer. Some of us will join the military. Some of us will immediately join the workforce. And still others will move on to more schooling. No matter which route each one of us takes, we can be sure that our experiences at Lake Tillman have paved the way for our success. Another thing people often assume is that we will always succeed. But let's be real, you will not always win all of your battles. There will be times when you fall over and over again, and sometimes things may seem impossible. But as we said here in Lake Tillman, you mustn't give up. There is always a light at the end of the tunnel, and you simply must persevere until you reach your goal. Remember, you were able to persevere for 12 years of hardship and struggle, and you've come too far just to give up in the near future. I have no doubt in my mind that each one of the graduates here will find a way to succeed in life, because we know the value of struggle, the power of failure, and that inspires us to stare down our challenges without fear, to have faith in ourselves, our determination, and our ability. I believe that it would be a good idea for us to set a unified goal for the class of 2020. For that, I challenge us to fight for what we believe in, to strive for what makes us happy, and to appreciate every moment given to us. This is to make sure that we have something to drive us forward, something that will, rem that will rem be remembered if we ever hit rock bottom. Remember, rock bottoms will teach you lessons that mountaintops never will. Congratulations. We have so much to be proud of. And I'm truthfully honored to be ta Lake Taylor's salutatorian and to be part of this distinguished graduating class. Thank you. Thank you, Alvin. At this time, it is my pleasure to introduce our senior class vice president, Nadia Brown. Good afternoon, fellow graduates of the class of 2020. This year's valedictorian is the vice president of Lake Taylor's National Honor Society. She's an avid member of our concert and advanced girls choir. She was selected for all state district chorus her freshman, sophomore, and junior year and she had the honor to perform at last year's Virginia International Tattoo. While our valedictorian has a deep love for music and the arts, she has chosen to pursue a career in journalism and will attend the College of William Mary on a full ride scholarship. It's my pleasure to introduce our valedictorian, Ava Edwards. Good afternoon, fellow Lake Taylor High School class of 2020. I think it is safe to say, if we've learned anything from our world's current predicament, it's that not everything is in our control. I personally never thought I would be wearing pajamas for three months straight or mastering the art of brownie baking, but here I am. These circumstances have allowed plenty of time for my own self-reflection and have taught me how to compartmentalize my stressors. Now I've learned that there are some things in life I can dictate. Whether I post that picture on Instagram, I'm not quite sure about, the music that I listen to, what color my prom dress will be, mine would have been black. But there are some things in life simply no one can oversee. Small things like the weather, or whether or not you're working a shift with anyone you actually like, or when the entire world falls apart in a matter of weeks. And that is okay. And at some point, you have to realize that you do not have control over every minute detail in your life. I think that with everything happening in the world right now, that this will help us to understand this fact. The esteemed author Toni Morrison once wrote, if you surrender to the wind, then you can ride it. In other words, sometimes you have to let go and just let things be. I truly believe that everything does happen for a reason, that there may be something greater at work, and while you may have to suffer for it now, you could be helping so many people down the road. I have tried to stop the wind from blowing so many times, and I've been beaten down and bruised up from it. But you cannot keep the wind from blowing. And sometimes you have to look at the bigger picture instead of one small fragment at a time and let the wind take you where it pleases. If more of us had this mindset, maybe school wouldn't be so stressful and we could learn to save our energy and find our own serenity. 
I have found peace within this chaos, knowing that letting go is okay, because the real mastery of life is knowing what is in your power to change and what is not. I truly believe we are all capable of finding peace within ourselves and becoming successful because of it. I would like to wish my fellow classmates of Lake Taylor luck on your journey of letting go. And I would like to thank some of those who have helped me and guided me through this difficult time, as well as my high school career. I would like to thank my family. I love you. Thank you for always believing in me and my abilities, especially my mom. She has always been and will always be my rock. I'd like to thank my friends for making school a little bit more tolerable and for giving me a reason to smile through the whirlwind of teenage emotions. I love each and every one of you, and you know who you are. I'd like to thank my choir for giving me so many unforgettable memories and experiences. And finally, I'd like to thank some of my teachers who have cared and helped for me along the way especially Ms. Cause. Thank you for being a beacon of light in the darkness and for caring for me and all of your students. Ms. Batoni, for making everyone smile and letting me sing ABBA in the classroom even though I know you hate them. Ms. Gauze, for helping me with my college essays and treating your students with genuine kindness. And Ms. Romero, for being so gentle and caring and for making the classroom a truly exciting place. Each and every person I mentioned has guided me along my journey. I could never truly express how much you all mean to me. And I will carry you and all of your memories with me for the rest of my life. Again, Lake Taylor Class of 2020, congratulations. I wish you all luck in this journey called life. Thank you. Thank you, Ava. At this time, please welcome Dr. Robin Stratton, Lake Taylor Schools Counseling Department Chair. Good afternoon. I'm Dr. Robin Stratton, Lake Taylor High School's School Counseling Department Chair. It is with great pleasure to announce that the class of 2020 has earned a total of $3,769,880 in scholarship offers. It has been a privilege and a pleasure working with such an exceptional group of students. Good luck and congratulations to all. Thank you, Dr. Stratton. At this time, we will recognize each of the members of the class of 2020 presented by Mr. Clayton Singleton. Shahida Brianna Abdullah. Jaden Sky Attic. Don Frankie Aguinaldo. Jeremy Dalowin Aguinaldo. Justin Anthony Alati, Victoria Imani Allen, graduating with honors. Jaquan Damian Allison. Cheyenne Manaya Alston. Danisha Ray Amos. Kevante Solomon Anderson with honors. William Angeles Hidalgo. Khalil Isaiah Anthony. Jacob Ligon Antolin. Pastor Pastrado Ark with honors. Diana Rene Armstrong with honors. Tassir Rajay Arps. Demisha Monet Bab. Termaine Alfonso Baker Jr. Brent Taylor Barnes. Trilamar Alexavier Baskus. Dejasia Janaya Baines. Rushan Unique Beal. Yvette Stella Badias. Xavier Jamal Billy. Lola Joe Boshad. Nakisha K. 
Kintaria bows with honors. Jordan Bernard Bright. Justin Brian Bright. Caleb Ryan Brinkley with honors. Kayla Monique Bristol. Kania Monet Bristol. And Treya Lenise Britton graduating with honors. NJROTC Leadership Academy student. Deshaun James Brooks graduating with honors. Nadia Marie Brown with honors. Daniel Eugene Bryan. Andre Taquan Burford. Dejan Shamar Burnham. Michaela Avell Marie Burton. Zion Joshua Burton. Cameron Devon Butts graduating with honors. Bianca Lanique Bird. Sherlisa Lassay Kennedy graduating with honors. Tristica Monet Kennedy graduating with honors. Ashanti Monique Carlisle. Divine Carter. Aaliyah Michelle Chapman. Renaija Takia Chapman. Basil Fitzgerald Charles. Jaquan Zycarl Christopher. Ketrick Lamonte Church. Shanasia Justina Clark graduating with honors. Aldwin Alistair Jr. Codrington. Christian Alexander Collin. Natrell Demik Sincere Collins. Jaquan Javante Coltrane. Natia Shante Corbin. Nature Nikel Candrell Watts. Kevin Tariq Crawford. Makai Shaman Crawford graduating with honors. Brianna Nicole Credle graduating with honors. Patrick Morato Kunanen graduating with honors. Brandon Alexander Davis. Cyrus Sean Davis. Janelle Ann Davis. Manaya Serenity Davis graduating with honors. Angeli Rose De La Puente. Tiana L. Deval graduating with honors. Alyssa Mopano Diaz graduating with honors. Mackenzie Amarissa Dominguez. Maya Jean Dalkerty graduating with honors. Robert Elijah Drummond graduating with honors. Kimaya Iyana Mary Duck. Gracie Lilith Ott Duke graduating with honors. Ariel Ernest. Natalie Faith Eden graduating with honors. Ava Grace Edwards graduating with honors. 
Brianna Monique Ellsworth, graduating with honors. Destiny Michelle Etheridge, graduating with honors. Motasia Ataya Evans. Genesis Gabrielle Facey, graduating with honors. Andre Pierre Ferguson. Ione Louisa Fitzgerald, graduating with honors. Jada Ashanti Flood. Eric Christopher Floyd. Megan Elizabeth Forkus, graduating with honors. Ethan Reginald Foster. Sienna Marie Garcia. Danielle Sinise Garcia, graduating with honors. Daniel Sinise Garcia, graduating with honors. Lamonte Zaquan Gaynor. Dimani Yakim Gilbert. Shamar Daquan Gomillion. Maquan Latrell Gray. Nikwan Tahim Greer Lyons. Malia Elizabeth Greggs, graduating with honors. Cheyenne Desiree Griffin, graduating with honors. Caleb Logan Hall, with honors. Thomas Darrell Harris. Jakia Tashe Harrison. Maya Deanna Hartley, graduating with honors. Nikayla Aaliyah Haskins. Jaze Demetrius Heaton. Jada Nicole Hill, graduating with honors. Breon Tashad Holly. Bodie Braden Holman. Dominique Leon Holmes, graduating with honors. Amelia Denise Howard, graduating with honors. Jari Kwame Howell. Elizabeth Dora Leanne Hugate. Anaya Shatoria Jackson, graduating with honors. Rashad Lamontre Jackson, NJROTC Leadership Academy student. Jada Aaliyah James. Tiana Monet James, graduating with honors. Sante Keyshawn Jarrett. Elijah Lamont Jefferson. Don Hedesiah Johnson, graduating with honors. Ariana Tashe Jones. Jada Latrell Jones. Larice Heaven Jones. Mercedes Alexis Jones. Wahoo Walker Jones. Jalik Jermaine Jordan. Shayla Trenice Jordan. Essence Zaisia Joyner. Savannah Lynn Kelly. Jacob Cole King. 
Robert Jefferson Kramer. Aldritz Arion Suba Lacambra. Nasir Kwase Lancaster. Aasia Lene Lawrence. Brianna Lynn Lawrence. Aaliyah Simone Lawson. Jamel Lee Leslie. Adriana Shanti Lewis. Taylor Love Lewis graduating with honors. Alvin Lynn graduating with honors. Davion Miguel Long. Angelo Lorenzo Lopez. Tyler Ryan Lynch graduating with honors. Cleante Raynell Mabry. Raylan Kivon Manley. Malik LaVar Martin. Amaya Nicole Matthews graduating with honors. Taquasia Rakia Mayo. Isaiah Mays. Devante Lamont McBurrows. Jalen Jaleel McCray graduating with honors. Patrick Malik McEachin graduating with honors. Demetrius Deshaun McLean Scobie. Dwayne Lawrence Massal. Jamel Tumbaga Miranda graduating with honors. Brooklyn Tiana Mitchell. Danasia Special Mitchell. Marquez Tashawn Mitchell. Zarel Ladante Mitchell. Delanta Lamont Moore Jr. Mahogany Allure Moray graduating with honors. Angelica Rochelle Mori Martinez graduating with honors. Sierra Janice Mosby. Amari Curtis Mosley. Aaliyah Men Muse graduating with honors. Keontae Mushari Newton. Brandy Ryan Obedoza graduating with honors. Charlene Taisha Pamp. Jessica Ann Pappas. Angelica Marie Pelletier. Julian Philip Perez graduating with honors. Serenity Lachey Perkins graduating with honors. Jordan Ilaria Poole. Karan Kenyatta Potter. Nathan Austin Potter. Shakaya Mache Pye graduating with honors. Terrell Earl Reed. Alexis Ariel Remsen. Tania Catrice Ricks. Shamaya Janae Riddick. Dakota Montana Roberts. Eddie Lee Roberts. 
Alex Sarmiento Roman. Jada Simone Sanders. Selena Desiree Saunders. Yushanti Jalisa Scott. Corinthian Amir Sesams. Jaira Janisha Silver, graduating with honors. Janasia Nashe Silvers. Nicholas James Sennett. Elijah Kenneth Slater. Denisha Tashana Smith. Enia Marie Smith. Nasir Jamed Smith. Sheila Charnay Smith, graduating with honors. Christopher LaShawn Sparks, Jr. Keon Lamont Spate. Dallas Lee Spruill, graduating with honors. Janelle Brianna Spruill. Elijah Hassan Squire. Asia Ruth Stewart, graduating with honors. DeAndre Christopher Strong. Zaire John Wesley Sumner. Sierra Marie Sylvester, graduating with honors. Tramisha Jordan Taylor. Stacy Joel Taylor Bryant. Caleb Antonio Tessier. Jalen Tashawn Thacker. Demond Spencer Tillman, graduating with honors. Jalisa Denise Trent. Tania Lachey Trotman, graduating with honors. Princess Kiara Ashun Turner. Ashard Malik Vincent. Sophia Loretta Visconti. Brianna Alicia Walker, graduating with honors. Charity Sarai Warren, with honors. Shakira Monique Washington. Benjamin Nathaniel Weeks. Tiana White. Tishawn Antrell Whitehurst. Terrell Divine Wiggins. Deasia Akala Wilkins. Daquel Devon Williams. Devin Keyshawn Williams. Gerard Demon Williams. Kimani Jamal Williams. Lisa Marie Williams. Anaid Donta Willis. Adrian Sue Wilson with honors. Alik Dayon Wise. Lanaya Amani Wood. Mackenzie Nichelle Woodrum graduating with honors. Akeem Kevon Wright. Frederick Bruce Wyatt graduating with honors. At this time, I would like to introduce the principal of Lake Taylor High School, Mrs. Letitia Wade Jenkins. As a principal of Lake Taylor High School, I certify that you, 
the members of the class of 2020 have successfully met and completed all of the state and local requirements necessary for graduation. Principal Wade Jenkins, members of the Lake Taylor High School administration, faculty and staff, family and friends, but most importantly, the class of 2020, greetings. Today is truly a historic and wonderful day. We all know that had life continued as normal, there would be happy cheers rocking the Chartway Arena right now. However, we are ready to celebrate you at home with your families, who I know are so excited to honor your wonderful achievement of graduating from high school. I hope you're feeling a real sense of pride today despite the circumstances. You have finished one journey and are now poised for that next one, be it college, the workforce, the military, or another exciting endeavor. Understandably, you may feel somewhat cheated. Your opportunity to walk across the stage to receive your diploma after 13 years of hard work appears to have been taken from you. But here's the truth. I don't believe that you really know and understand just how special you are. At no time in our history has a graduating class received such an outpouring of love and respect. Social media has been full of congratulatory salutes. Celebrities have stepped forward to speak to you about how important you are during this critical time in our world's history. To many, you represent our deepest, most profound hope for the future. There's more than a little irony that this should happen to the class of 2020. As we all know, 2020 is the standard for perfect vision. The beauty of our situation is that it will be the ingenuity and commitment of visionary people who are looking beyond returning us to normal and instead are intent on creating a different kind of world. A world where access to healthcare services is not confined largely to people who can afford it. A world where justice prevails over self-interest. A world built on respect for individuals rather than their positions in life. After all, don't you find it significant that people who are deemed essential were not only the heroic health care workers and public safety officials who risk their lives daily for us, but also those individuals who deep clean our buildings, serve us food, and stock our groceries? In her commencement speech to the graduating class of Tennessee State University, Oprah Winfrey described the class of 2020 as the chosen class, chosen for such a time as this. Yes, you are the class, chosen to turn disappointment into determination. You are the class that epitomizes resiliency. I know there are many, many stories of resiliency at Lake Taylor High School, but let me share one example from your graduating class. Michaela Burton faced a situation most children would find daunting when her family circumstances required her to enter foster care. From those experiences, she developed severe depression and anxiety. Regrettably, Michaela initially suffered from some bullying. Some might have been tempted to give up, but she had the presence of mind to seek support from caring adults and her friends. She availed herself to the great resources of Lake Taylor High School, such as the school security officers and guidance counselors. Michaela said that they helped her to see her worth. Their encouragement, along with the support of her peers, strengthened her resolve and her self-confidence. Michaela will be attending Tidewater Community College in the fall to pursue a career in practical cooking. And very importantly, she aspires to be a role model for others who are struggling with mental health issues as she did. She wants to pay for it the kindness she has received from others. And that is such an astute and wonderful way to proceed in life. 
like Michaela, all of you can and I believe will take the lessons learned from any pain or disappointment you experienced and move forward with purpose. You have watched the world come together to feed the hungry, heal the sick, and educate those who could no longer walk through the doors of a school building. You have witnessed the real definition of an essential service, an unselfish commitment to the welfare of other human beings. Remember that the saying, we're all in this together, is not just a hashtag, but today's world anthem. Carry that knowledge into your new endeavors in a way that no other graduating class has done before you. Commit to setting the stage for a new future, one in which you personally commit to advancing justice, equity, and dignity for everyone in this world of ours. Because ultimately, love and kindness are truly the most essential services of all. I now proudly accept Lake Taylor High School's graduating class of 2020, and by virtue of the authority invested in me by the Commonwealth of Virginia and the School Board of the City of Norfolk, with all the rights, honors, and privileges thereto pertaining, I hereby declare this class of 2020 graduates of Norfolk Public Schools. Congratulations and best wishes. Would the class of 2020 please stand? Lake Taylor graduates of 2020, would you please move your tassel from the right to the left, signifying that you are an official graduate of Lake Taylor High School. Congratulations, graduates. We're proud of you and we love you. This is Principal Wade Jenkins here with the faculty and staff at Lake Taylor High School. We're here to wish the class of 2020 a farewell. We are so proud of all of you and love each and every one of you. Remember, you are a titan and destined for success. Farewell. <laughs> Miss you. Congratulations, Titans! Yay! Congratulations, seniors! Woo! We'll miss you, love you. Congratulations, good luck! Felicitaciones, congratulations. Congratulations, farewell. Congratulations, class of 2020. Seniors, good luck. Congratulations, good luck. Congratulations, class of 2020. Keep the dream. Congratulations. Congratulations. Congratulations, we're proud of you. Good luck. Congratulations, love you. Bye, guys. I'm so proud of you. Good luck. Good luck. Congratulations. Congrats, guys. Congratulations and Godspeed. Way to go, 2020. Bye, 2020. Good luck. Good luck, everyone. Congratulations, 2020. Congratulations, 2020. Congratulations. <laughs> Stay in the game. Congratulations, you guys. Congratulations, guys. Good luck. Good job. Congratulations. Tell life what to do. Congratulations. Make good choices in life. Congratulations. Good luck. Miss you. Love you. You did it. Congratulations. 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 Keep reading. Congratulations, 2020. Tighten up. <laughs> Congratulations, class of 2020. 20. Soar high, class of 2020. Way to go, seniors. Congrats. Best of luck. World, here you come. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Way to go, guys. Keep learning. Make history. Okay. Everybody yell. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs>